Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb, welcome back to this let's play of Europa Universalis. Let's see now, I think we're gonna mint a bit. Because we're gonna need money. I mean, Niagara is under attack. And these poor explorers, they're suffering quite a bit. Um, we still want to colonize up the shore here. Yeah, we're gonna colonize the th these three provinces and then I'll have to reevaluate where we want to go. Oh, is that Denmark again? Wouldn't be surprised. Fail there. When you at first you fail, try, try again. You have all your buildings, you're still building fortifications. Roanoke needs a couple of buildings. You need a couple of buildings. After you. Level 3 fort, but not the interior structures. Ah, oh, that's sad, bro. That's sad, Spain. Very sad. You're done. Oh, a new monarch, that's fine. Henry the Third. Let me look at its stats in a second. Just need to verify that I don't have any buildings I need to build. Okay, so new Mukmanark. And he's pretty darn good. So we're we're doing good on everything except diplomacy. <laughs> Go figure. Yeah, I know our diplomacy is a bit subpar. For some reason everybody hates us. Can't imagine why. Need more infantry. And now we need to funnel back into army tech. <sighs> I don't know when we're going to get the uh, CB on, on, when we can declare war on Spain again. That's the thing. Delaware has a fort so you can move up here. And I clearly don't have a CB on these fellers. And there's no fabrication and nothing like that at all. And the only CB we have is against Spain. And we can't really take advantage of that one. I suspect. Nope, we still, still have a truce. Uh, Mantua, that's over here. Smash and burn. Fourteen thousand, that's a hell of a lot of money. Hell of a lot of money, but still. I, I think we want to focus on getting uh, the next level of army tech. Simply because that's going to allow level 3 uh, fortresses. And we're going to build a whole shit ton of those. I.e. we're going to build them everywhere. Uh, and mint everything and everything. Definitely. Okay, the journey over here is pretty quick. By the, by the looks of things. Um, they seem to get there before I can even click the buttons. Uh, right, we're trying to build up the army here as well. I think this is going to suffice. We're going to split a uh, group of this and split it. Possibly. Or just group them up. That's fine too. 
That should be enough to siege down this fortification. Don't know why Spain doesn't pay to fortify their settlements. Not complaining, mind you. It's, that's great news for us. England decided to settle here. Okay, fair enough. I'm sure we'll be at war with you soon enough. Come to think we do have a truce. We do not have a truce. Interesting. And you're still at war with... <laughs> Still at war with, Port, uh, with Poland. A truce is up? Really? Already? Yes, a truce with Spain is up. Oh, interesting. So, um... <laughs> Where is Spain's army? It's all the way up here. Okay, who are your friends, Spain? Do you have any friends? Scotland, the Pope, and Nubia. Yeah, I don't think Nubia is going to be a big deal for us. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm going to split and split this again. And you are going to go up here and be a and siege that down. You're going to go to Bern and our leader. It's gonna go to lunch dock. Uh, yeah, there are quite a few troops over here though. Not that it truly matters. I think we're gonna be able to do a tiny bit of a shock and awe thing here. But yeah, we're going to sort out our troops here like this. We are going to fight Spain. I think at least we'll be able to do a quick war with them. Um, I Actually, I probably want to make two smaller armies. Not there. I'm going to make a smaller army here. Which goal is to go and, and occupy... Various territories. Let's act with it. Let's. Uh, we can just put a few troops out of this one. Because you take quite a bit of attrition going in here. Uh, yeah, that's fine. So let's just move our troops into position. Can't sit here without taking attrition, right? Apparently not. Definitely not. We lost like ugh, thousands of troops just sitting there. Ugh, what a mistake. We're getting quite a few colonists. I keep forgetting to send them. Uh, Manhattan is actually done. Uh, let's start with Powhatan. Build a fortification there, please. Now this one can't dry it, so you move here. <laughs> yes, my dear Spain. I am going to fight you again. And you are going to die. Because that is what you do. Florence, Landstock. Oh, I thought that was his half arm. Oh, damn it. Okay, got it. Yeah, that's fine. Throw everything at this one and destroy his army. 
and sort things out that way. There we go. Okay, so... That's 34,000 troops. He has quite a lot of troops over here in Italy. But that's okay. I just have to defend over there. Uh, <laughs> no. I don't have to, because they're already at war with him, I think. Yep, they are. So, you move in there. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to attack and win there, but you're going to try anyway. Cairn was also in this. Scotland we can't do anything with. Nubia has joined the war. Yes, of course. Nubia is a natural ally to Spain. Right? And quickly, we're going to do some quick uh, changes here. Um, split the large army. And let's see, are you the... No, you're not. You're not. There we go, that's the 2001. <laughs> and the second we did that, oh, you know what, I'm, I have no army, but you're declaring wars. I want to fight you. Okay, so now we're at war with uh, England, Venice, uh, the Hanseatic League, Mysore. Uh, most of these we don't really give, give a damn about. Portugal. You know what, this army, instead of going there, just go to Portugal. I don't know if I can take uh, colonies in a peace deal like this. That is, colonies that aren't finished. Damn it, Montgomery died. Or, well, that guy. I'm gonna call him Montgomery. It's close enough. And that's... Well, that wasn't you. Never mind then. Yeah, go figure. All of a sudden, everybody's inside. You know what? You wanna fight you. And the papal forces actually escaped me here. Uh, in that case, we're going to wait. They're going to go into that province and attrition a fair bit. Uh, so that was Austria. And France. Austria, Bavaria, Hungary. Let's see now. Uh, that one I'm going to call you into. Which you accepted. This one I don't really care. We took that. Check that. Go there. Go there to burn. So let's see. We only only hold three provinces of Spain. But apparently, an unseized province isn't quite as valuable. But they would probably take a province for. Uh, they would probably give me one single province. Not that it matters, it is Zacatecas I want to get a hold of. Um, what do you have over here? You have actually colonized the entire coast. So you're going to march up there and just take control of everything. Um, you're going to march there at least, and then I need to march on the interior here and see if we can find the exact limits of Spain. Those colonists are still moving. Let's train a couple of thousand men over here. Just to harass the English. Here though, so we're definitely not going to sit with this kind of army here. Uh, move, I want to see if I can... 
sort this out. Yeah, that's 20,000 men stuck. And you're gonna move. You're actually gonna split up. You're gonna move there. You're gonna move there. That's gonna be fine. Uh, most of your armies are actually moving north. I wanna see if I can intercept them. So let's see. We are at war with just about everybody. Again. Uh, Austria is again trying to reclaim this territory, which is fine. There goes Denmark. Lovely. Oh, dang it, that's, that stopped all our armies. Ah. Move. And move. Uh, not Tampico. Uh, and no. I want you in one war. I don't want you into all these wars. I don't want you to fight Russia and Denmark. That's going to that's gonna lead to a massive loss. Um, dang it. I guess we're back at this point. We just need more young men to die for the for the country. Uh, right now we don't have money. We need to wait for the minting to finish. And there comes Netherlands. I was wondering. Uh, so we're definitely gonna burn here. Need to slow him down somehow. Let's go and do something over here. And this is all trade company land, so... That's going to burn. Siege in Castile. <laughs> you can go that way, that's fine. Uh, no, I'm not going to call you into that war either. Uh, he's going to run away. You just killed the Pope. It's going to be fine. What are we fighting? Oh, are you assaulting somewhere? So Our army is just melting away. And this is going to happen every time you fight Spain, simply because they are the strongest power on the map. So obviously, everybody thinks, oh, he's weak. Or rather, he's busy with the strongest power on the map. Now it's the time for us to jump in. That's what they do. Over and over and over and over again. And they can because I am at the bad boy threshold, which is invisible, as far as I know. And obviously it's not going to get any better the more territory I eat. Uh. I'm almost tempted to go with this, to be honest. But no. Yeah, 
you are gonna lose a hell of a lot more than that Spain. Hell of a lot more. Speaking of, let's burn the Yucatan one. But I really want this one to fall. Uh, how much attrition am I suffering? Not, not, nothing right now. It's gonna take a long time to siege. But that is the absolute essential thing to capture here. Everybody else, we're pretty much just trying to sta stalemate. I don't really care about the rest. Um, I'm gonna split your forces. You're gonna go there. You're gonna go to Rome. Or we could not care about this at all and go straight for... You know what? We're gonna merge... Go to Styria. Right, we're at war with Venice as well. Um, <laughs> Bulk of his forces decided to go and play wall with Austria, with uh, Pressburg there, which is fine. Let's take Styria and go straight for uh, Vienna. I think. Try to knock out uh, that war. Because that's a real power war, to be honest. That's the problem problematic war. Uh, Portugal, we're probably going to be able to white piece rather quickly. Because I don't really want anything from them. Just need to take Tago. Spain we could knock out at any time. And here we just need to recover some troops. They're more than willing to fight even though they have no <laughs> chance of winning. That's a sad thing. We've seen that in the AI several times now. Go to Powhatan. Uh, right, that's fine. Under siege, under siege, under siege. Rustling on the socks already fallen. Excellent. Uh, yeah, go up there. Actually got Navarra. And Spain is more than willing to make peace. But it won't matter, I need Zacatecas to fall. I need Zacatecas. And the rest of Spain is pretty much under wraps. Uh, actually, he's moving forces here. I don't want to move into that line of fire just yet they're gonna group up a ton of troops here right, right at the bayou at the bayou um, go there and down to me yeah, you know, I, I kind of wanted this province but uh, I'm okay with not getting it we're going to go this way and just pillage and burn. These are actual colonies, I can't burn them. I have Costa Rica. These are also all actual colonies. Can't burn them. Go there and conquer that one. Need more troops. Six, six, six armies. That's lovely. Now, of course, they don't have any morale, so they'll. They'll die if I try to do anything. You'd attrition quite a bit if you go through there. You'd be safer going through Tyrol, actually. So I'll do that. And then go straight for Vienna. If you have any survivors. I 
It's kind of sad how I'm sieging all that stuff down way faster than Zacatecas. Then again, I pro it's probably because we don't have cannon. So let's try to fix that. Let's recruit some cannon. And then we'll see if that's going to be sufficient to convince Zacatecas to fall. As for all the other wars we're in... Um, Most of them I don't really give a damn about, to be honest. But we'll see. Uh, I hope to just stalemate the Netherlands again. Uh, I do want to see if I can nix the Danish, though, and get rid of their colony over here. And I'm going to test that with... Uh, test that with Micmac. Actually, I can test that now, can I? Let's see. You have... Trujillo. Oh, you have a peace offer pending. Uh, decline that. Offer peace. Demand. <laughs> okay. This is interesting. So I can't... Uh, yeah, colony in progress. Like, the, like this one. Oh, no, wait a sec, that's Honduras. Never mind, the province's name is Honduras. Uh, okay, I can't can ask for it. I was starting to wonder if I couldn't ask for an unfinished colony, if there was some kind of loophole there. Regardless, it is time for a break. We shall see if we can wrap this war up next time. I doubt it, but we'll get closer at least. Thank you for watching.